They appear to be alive in a days of our lives peak for the week of February 20 to 24. Check out the preview and read what transpires below. On Valentine's Day, Kayla contacted Steve from beyond the grave, since it was their anniversary, or one of them at least, and it was their anniversary. She explained to him that Nick, posing as Adrienne, had duped her into selling her soul, and that she had not landed in a pleasant place. Naturally, Tripp then arrived home and roused Steve from his sleep, but the message from Kayla was genuine. After a private meeting with the one and only Satan back in the afterlife, he made the offer to set Kate and Kayla's souls free, but only if Marlena accepted to be his lifelong companion. Meanwhile, Nick made fun of Kayla and Kate by telling them that their husbands intended to murder Orpheus in order to exact revenge for their deaths. Roman and Kate briefly communicated, with Kate pleading with him to abandon the scheme, but Nick cut them off. But, when Kayla and Kate learned that Marlena had accepted Satan's offer, they forbade her from following through and informed Nick that the arrangement was off. John and Steve had transported Orpheus back to Earth and into custody, where they were getting ready to administer his own medication. In a last-ditch effort to preserve his life, Orpheus offered to reveal to them the real killer of their spouses. In the sneak peek of what's to come, a scene from heaven is displayed, and Kate can be heard trying to reach Roman once more, but connecting only to Paulina. Are you saying we aren't dead? Kate then asks in a voice that can be heard. That's exactly what I'm saying, Jake's voice can be heard replying. How can we be living if this isn't the earth, Marlena wonders? Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, Daily Bulletin News, and stay with us.